Hi guys, how's it going? So today we're going to be talking about how Facebook are banning people who are creating two separate Facebook accounts, one for their social media and then another one for the Oculus. Hello, bonjour, comment ça va? Welcome to you. If you're here to the channel for your very first time, this is of course VR Essentials, where we talk about the practical uses of virtual reality. And welcome back to all our regular subscribers. Ooh, very nice to see you again. As always, thank you very much for your support on the channel. So today we're talking about how Facebook are banning people who are creating two separate accounts, one for their Oculus Facebook device, and then the other for their social media as a separate account. So there are news reports that are floating around, link in description below the like button, so you can go and read these on the own time that yeah basically you cannot have two Facebook accounts one for your Facebook VR headset and then another for your social media it doesn't work that way the fact is that they need to have as many users as possible real users because they're using your real name your real last name and you know you cannot fake this otherwise if they ban you from your social media your oculus device which is owned by Facebook will also equally be that's it, banned. You will not have access to it. You will then have to recreate a new account. And if you spend, let's say, an extra 100 US dollars or 500 US dollars on different apps or what have you not, then you're going to lose all that data. It is really that simple. Now, I've done a number of videos as to why Facebook have priced their new VR headset at such a low cost. I'll put a link in the description below the like button, which you may want to go and check out after this video. But the fact is, if you're someone who is trying to create two separate Facebook accounts, one for your VR headset and then one for your social media, it already goes to show that you don't trust the platform. The US House, which has conducted a 16-month long investigation on Facebook, has found very recently that they breached anti-competitive laws, anti-trust laws. The EU, which are putting a lot of pressure on Facebook, may have to force them to bow out completely. We're going to know this in about a couple months' time. Germany, which have banned any sales whatsoever of Facebook products within Germany because they don't comply to their standards and their laws. And now Australia, very recently, have also said that Facebook are going against their anti-data privacy laws, which means they may also have to stop sales of the products. There's a place 